Hello cozy friends and welcome to this gorgeous spring day. It is 24 degrees today. It is the warmest day of the year, like the, the first warm day of this year. It is amazing. And you know, it's just like so warm that I could have easily just worn a t-shirt, but I'm just keeping my cardigan on because I don't want to get too over enthusiastic and catch a cold or something. Also, like if you were here a week ago with the previous video, when I also went for a beautiful spring walk, that was literally two days ago. So, and I was still wearing a scarf and my teddy coat and I needed that because the wind was still really cold but now it's just really, it's kind of sultry, it's cool but it's warm, it's amazing, absolutely amazing. So I'm excited to bring you guys along today, um, just let me know what is the weather like where you are, you're enjoying your very first warm spring days as well, just let me know. And um, for now we are going to go on, I'm going to spot some more flowers, maybe do a little bit of reading too because it's so lovely like I don't even want to go inside and I say that a hermit anyway thank you so much for being here I hope you will enjoy this video and let's get on with this beautiful beautiful spring walk Hey there friends and welcome to Monday. So um, I actually 
realized that I hadn't really properly shown those stickers I got the other day. I already used one for my diary yesterday. This is like the first page. And then you've got these in really beautiful green and yellow shades. And then you've got these really cute ones with little tags on them. You belong among the wildflowers and let your dreams blossom. It is so cute. Anyway, speaking of stickers, diaries, journals, that is actually the point of this video because we are now in April. Oh, look, look who's here. Like I said, we are now in April, which means that the first quarter of 2024 is already behind us. And I realized like in last week's video I already mentioned that I wanted to slow down a bit this spring season, but I also want to make sure that I refocus on the goals I set for myself at the start of this year. So if you remember the first video of this year, I uh, wrote down all of my goals for 2024. There were 10 of them. So I just want to like set myself back on track, see what I need to work a little bit on and, um, you know, make some new goals based, based off on those goals for the next three months. So this is actually the first time ever in my life that I'm doing this, but I think it's really helping me to keep track of the things I want to achieve because it is so easy to forget the things you say you want to do at the start of the year, right? Because I don't know, it's like at the start of January, you're still in that holiday bliss anything seems possible you're like oh i've got all the time in the world this year because i've got a whole new year ahead of me and then before you know it time just slips away and you often fall back into older bad habits which you don't need anymore or you kind of forgot the goals you were working towards so i really want to refocus in this video so this is really a, a spring reset so um i'm planning to do that as well during the summer and then autumn and then you know for the rest of this year first of all together i want to go through these goals for 2024 i set for myself at the start of this year and then after that we are going to do some journaling and um well refocus on certain goals and see what i can plan to to make those things happen so um let's check them out out, shall we? Alright, and the first goal was make more cozy vlogs. Well, I haven't missed a single vlog for a single week this year. So I think I'm doing well, so I don't need to refocus on this one. Then open an Etsy shop for my journal stickers, no longer handmade. <laughs> um, this is going to take a while because I'm still like trying to see what will work for me, what my options are. So um, I'm thinking there are going to be digital drawn stickers instead. So um, I think that my goal for the next three months is just going to be to just keep drawing and just see what my options are, like maybe digital products as well such as wallpapers um yeah i'm still just figuring things out so we will definitely focus on that refocus on that for the next few few months start writing a book yeah um i started off rather well in january and a little bit in february like writing down ideas uh writing down the entire concept but that is all i did because in march i got very distracted by playing final fantasy 7 rebirth so this is definitely something i want to refocus on as well uh keep doing yoga i've been keeping it up so that's okay no need to refocus on that Go for regular walks. Um, I have been refocusing on that for the last few weeks. As you have probably noticed during the latest videos I've uploaded. So that's going well as well. Maintain a healthy work pace. That's going well for me too. I almost started to stress myself out at the start of the year. But I realized what my goal was. So uh, that's going well. So no need to refocus on that. Uh, focus on positivity and joy, not on anxiety and sadness. Still a very good one. I think I'm doing pretty okay. So um, yeah, that's fine too. Read more books. That is definitely one I need to refocus on. I did really well in January, February too. Well, no, not really. February kind of messed up as well. So for the next few months, definitely need to make more time to read more books. Play video games. Don't need to refocus on that because I've been doing that a lot and spend time with my loved ones. Um, yeah, I think I'm doing a pretty good job at that as well. So there isn't a whole lot I need to really refocus on, but uh, there are several points that I really want to remind myself of. So anyway, let's uh, take these points with us. So that is sticker Etsy shop story. It is the writing a book and it's really read more books. So I guess, you know, this is actually not too bad. I I'm doing better than I thought that I was. So I'm rather pleased actually. Anyway, let's um, 
start journaling and take note of these little points and then uh, we'll talk some more later in this video
So hello my cozy spring friends. So I just finished adding my very first April entries to my journal and I really have to say that writing down my goals makes me feel way more organized. You know like you can think things you want to do, you can think about things you want to do, but writing them down makes you seem more real. And like I said, I feel way more in control somehow. So um, if you've got any plans and you really want to follow up on those plans, do write them down, like on paper or just take your phone. It really, really helps. It just, I don't know, I think it's a mindset thing. Um, I've always heard people talk about that, but this year I'm truly doing it, truly trying it out. And I have to say, it already seems to be working. So yeah. I'm feeling good, I'm feeling optimistic and excited about the next three months. So this will be my plans for April, May and June. So I just want to ask like, uh, do you have any plans you want to achieve within the next three months or just plans you want to work on, like you don't need to achieve anything yet? I think that small, tiny steps, those are great too. You don't need to take big, big strides, just small steps, small steps at a time. Um, you know, they, they bring you a long way in the end as well. So just take it easy. But if you've got any plans and you would like to share them down below in the comments, please let me know. I would love, love to hear them. So um, I hope that you enjoyed this little video. I hope that maybe it has been helpful if you've been thinking about things you want to do. So yeah, so thank you so much for being here. I hope once more, I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you also had a cozy, relaxing time. And um, I hope to see you guys again in the next video as well. So if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit the like button maybe even subscribe to the cozy herbert channel if you haven't already and uh, we'll see each other again next week in a new video so until we meet each other again as always stay cozy